Good day traders. I wanted to uh, illustrate to you a setup that we saw this morning in the broad market index future. We were actually looking for this play before the market even opened and I'll uh, show you why here before I get into the in intricacies of this play. We know from statistical uh, evaluation that markets tend to fill the gaps sooner than later uh, faster if uh, market internals support that gap fill. Not only did we have a gap fill to the downside this morning, but key support just on the other side at that 1625 level. So we saw the open coming in at 1632.75. We knew the tendency could be to fill that gap early if market internals support us. Well, lo and behold, the market opened there at 1632.75, came in in the first couple of minutes, set that early range low at 1630.50 before taking a bounce higher. Well, after it took that bounce, that's when I put in the short trigger entry at the 1630.25, which was a tick below that 1630.50 early range low. It came down, tagged it, triggered, chopped around a bit, actually stopped this out. Uh, after it had triggered, but the reason we stayed in with this play is that it had not filled that gap. Number one, market internals were still uh, moderately negative, and I still had that key support level down here that was a draw. So market internals were still in our favor. The market was just chopping around a bit. Well, lo and behold, we continued to the downside, enough for a great partial play to the downside before this took a bounce, stopped us out, and actually whipped back down once again. But uh, my point here is not particularly uh, the winning short play, but to see where high probability plays can set up even before the market opens. And today, it was a draw in to fill that gap and follow through to that uh, key support level at 1625, which led us to this short play today. So until next time, this is Mark Lycos. Enjoy your day and trade well.